Sorry for the quality of audio. This is a very quick response to a question asked by Craig UK37, where he asks if you can convert inputs one and two of an audio interface into a single mono channel for use with NVIDIA's RTX voice software. And the answer is yes. If we go into Audacity here, you can see I have two microphones plugged in. The very first one that I'm using is the one that I'm speaking through right now, and the other one is very, very quiet. Let me turn that up a little bit. So as you can see, they're, they're both active and they're both live right now. And in order to get these to be one mono track coming out of the left channel for NVIDIA RTX to pick up on, we're going to need a piece of software called Voice Meter Banana. I'll leave a link in the description on how to install this, and hopefully, let me reinitialize. It'll look exactly like this when you finally open it up. From this point, go to hardware and set it to your audio interface, and then under IntelliPan, right-click it twice to get over to where it says position, and then take this center block here and bring it all the way over to the left channel so it's only outputting from the left channel. And while we're also down here, make sure to turn off A1 on this very first track and then to also bring up mono. This will combine both the left and right stereo tracks into a mono signal. And the only thing left to do now is to add an output. So in this case, I'm just going to add the Behringer audio interface again. As you can see, I'm getting a signal coming from the left channel now, which we weren't getting before. If I go back to stereo, you can see that the that the only audio coming out of this track is the very quiet left channel mic. But if we bring it back to mono, now it's also mixing that with the very loud right channel mic. The only other thing that you need to know on Voice Meter Banana is that this master section right here, the very second to last track, is getting a signal output for B1. Since we know that that's good now, we can open up NVIDIA's RTX voice, set it to voice meter output. In this case, it'll be just the normal VIO, not audio mixed. And then if we go back into Audacity, get rid of that, and change the output to NVIDIA's RTX voice, now we can see that it is picking up both audio channels from voice meter banana. And if I were to, say, move the microphone I'm talking to further away over here, and then also turn up the audio from the second microphone that I have, without moving the first microphone, you'll see that it does indeed mix both of those tracks together and output it as one single mono source. So hopefully that uh, answered your question. And if you have any questions, again, put them in the description or put them in the comment section. I'll see if I can help out there. Anyway, uh, yeah, good luck.